Let's play. K. Hey, Melody. Yes, Kate. I'm so excited we're gonna finally become roommates. Me too. I think our furniture shipment is about to arrive. Hey, do you hear that? I think it's the moving truck with our new furniture. Thanks to McDonald's, Melody and Rainbow Kate are gonna get a house makeover, and this is super exciting. And I have this enormous bag of McDonald's Happy Places Happy Meal toys. Here's what the checklist looks like. It is for Shopkins Happy Places. Turn any space into a happy place. Which is what we're gonna be doing for their new house. Here is what the checklist looks like. We have Puppy Patio, we have a Dreamy Bear set, a Kitty Kitchen set, and a Bathing Bunny set. Let's go ahead and open up all these pieces of furniture as well as the blind boxes and see what we can fill in our checklist. So far, I have three toys. This is one, this is two, this is three. We have three blind boxes as well as three pieces of furniture. We have a cute little kitty stove with a little stove top and we have little knobs and a little door right here with an adorable face. We have this cute little kitty shelf that has this little compartment here to store things as well as this little table top. And we have this cute little orange table with little green ears and a cute little kitty face with this green little post. For this portion of the house, I'm gonna make the little kitchen. We're gonna put the little tabletop here. Let's put the stove right here and we'll also have this little shelf. Let's open up the first blind box and see what we get. And what's super cool about these little boxes is that you can pop open the little ears as well as the little paws on the side. And it makes a cute, adorable little pet pin. So for the first box, we got the little tea kettle. And for tea time, we'll go ahead and put this little tea kettle right here on top of the stove. For the next kitty kitchen item, we get, ooh, a cute little toaster. Here is what the toaster looks like. It has the kitty face with the pink ears and a little piece of kitty toast on top. Let's store the little toaster right here on this countertop. What else do we get for the kitty kitchen? Oh, we got another toaster. Very cute. And for now, since we don't have a countertop, we'll go ahead and put this on top of the table. Here are two more little kitty kitchen sets. Let's open up this one real quickly. And it looks like we have another little stand. Let's place this stand next to the stove on the other side, and now we can add the toaster. And for this blind box, we have, very cool, it looks like we have a little skillet. This one is a chrome silver color with pink ears and a pink little handle. Let's place it on top of this little table. And we have another toy, but this one is a little bit different. We have this cute set of drawers. They have two green drawers with a cute little kitty face, so we could put the skillet on top of this little stand. I'm gonna place this little drawer set right next to this little shelf, and we'll put the skillet right here on top. We have one more blind box, so let's see what this one is. Oh wow, looks like we have a double. This one is another little kettle. And what I like about it is that it has this little thermometer so you can see what the temperature is for the water that you're boiling. And for now, we'll just put the kettle on top of the table. So far for the kitty kitchen, we got the table, the toaster, the shelf, the stove, the little drawer set, and the kettle. And we also got this neat little ultra rare. Super cool. Now let's move on to the bathing bunny series. Each one of these Petkins blind boxes pops out into a little bunny with little paws and bunny ears. And the first piece of furniture that we got is a cute little pink bathtub. Let's place a little bathtub right here in the corner so we can make a cute little bathroom. And for the first bunny bathroom set blind box, we get adorable. We get this cute little purple brush and it has yellow bristles and it has little blue ears. And we'll go ahead and put the brush right here on this bottom shelf like so. For the next toy, the piece of furniture that we got was this cute little basket. It has a cute little bunny tail right here, a pink little rim around the basket, pink ears, and a cute little bunny face. Let's put the little basket right here next to the brush, and we'll just put the brush right here inside of the basket. And for this bunny blind box, we get Oh, cool, looks like we got a nice set of bunny pink fuzzy towels. I like the little purple ears on this as well, and it has a front and a back. Let's hang this little towel where it's accessible for the bathtub right here. For the next bathing bunny series, we got a cute little bunny sink. 
and on it it has little blue ears and a little knob so you can turn the hot and cold water on. Let's place the sink close to the bathtub right here. And for this bunny blind box we get Ooh, very nice. We have a light pink metallic mirror with yellow ears for the bunny. We'll go ahead and put the mirror right here next to the hairbrush so that Melodine and Kate can do their hair. This is the last and final piece of furniture from the Bathing Bunny series. We have this cute little shelf. And this is a little bunny shelf with the blue little countertop and a pink little compartment to store things. I'm gonna move the little basket up here to this little shelf and we'll store this shelf right here in this compartment. For the final bunny blind box we have, ooh, this is another mirror, but this one is different. This one is blue and it's metallic, so let's place this mirror right next to the pink one. That way Melodine and Kate can each have their separate mirrors. Or with this little sink, we have this little slot so that we can add the little mirror and make it into a little vanity. Now we have this little lovely vanity, which I'm gonna put right here. Oh wow, Melodine, this bathroom set is divine. Now we can get ready together. Here is the checklist for the bathing bunny. We still haven't gotten any of the blow dryers or the rare blue towel. And there's also an ultra rare brush and an ultra rare blow dryer that we can get. Now let's open up the Dreamy Bear set of toys. Here is what the Dreamy Bear little blind box looks like. It is a blue bear and it has cute little pink ears and little pink paws. Let's open up this blind box first and see what we get. Aw, we have a cute little pink teddy bear pillow. And on the back it has little flowers and a cute little teddy bear tail. Let's display the pillow right here on this bigger bed. And for the furniture we got this really dreamy cute little teddy bear bed. And this one is pink with blue little ruffles and it has a cute little pink comforter on it. Perfect for a shoppy to sleep in. We'll go ahead and place the bed right here and we're gonna make a nice little bedroom area. Did somebody say bed? I'm awfully tired already. Woo, woo, woo. Oh, this bed is so comfortable. And I'm gonna take a nap right here. We also got for the piece of furniture for that blind box, a cute little sofa chair. This one is a blue bear and it has the pink ears, the cute face, and little pink pegs. Since we are lacking chairs here in the dining area, I'm gonna put a chair right here so that a shoppy can sit here and enjoy some tea. Now let's open this blind box and see what we get. Looks like we got another little pillow, but this is a darker pink color and the back is just solid without the flower pattern. Since Melodine has a little pillow, let's give Rainbow Kate one. Our next piece of furniture that we get is this cute little winky face teddy bear table. This will be a perfect little like writing desk for one of the shoppies. Let's put the little writing desk right here. Next piece of furniture that we got is this cute little pink and blue teddy bear nightstand. This one looks like the teddy bear is actually sleeping. And of course on the back it has the adorable little tail. We'll put the nightstand right here next to Rainbow Kate's bed. And this blind box we have Looks like we also have another little mirror, but this is the teddy bear one, and it is silver and chrome. It has pink ears, and it has a silver little mirror slot, and a cute little teddy bear face. Let's place the mirror right here on top of the nightstand. Next piece of furniture we got is a double. This is another little sofa chair, but like I said, since we don't have any chairs for the kitchen, we're gonna go ahead and improvise and use this one. Let's put this little sofa chair right here so we have a seating for two. Two more little blind boxes. Let's open up this one and what do we have? Ooh, it looks like we have a nice little cozy, hot pink little teddy bear footstool. Let's put the footstool right here next to the little table desk. And for our final blind box we have, ooh, this is a blue little footstool. So we have one for Melodine as well as one for Rainbow Kate. Let's place this blue footstool right here next to the pink one so that they both can have one. Here is everything that we have for the Dreamy Bear set. I still haven't gotten any lamps, but we have a rare footstool, we have a rare little mirror, and we also have an ultra rare little pillow. This is what the puppy patio little blind boxes look like. They have the cute little light pink puppy ears, we have a hot pink face, and two cute little pink paws. Let's open up this blind box first. Ooh, 
cool. It looks like we have a little umbrella with a little puppy right here on top. This umbrella is like a hot pink color and it has an orange little pulse. For now, we'll go ahead and set up the patio right here on the bottom story. I'm gonna put the umbrella right here. And the furniture that we got for the umbrella is this cute little puppy yellow slide. I'll just set the slide up right here. I'll rearrange this furniture in a little bit. There, I went ahead and moved all the bedroom furniture up here to the top where Rainbow Kate is sleeping. For our next furniture, we have this cute little puppy patio chair. It's light pink in color and has hot pink ears. I'm gonna put the little patio chair right here underneath the umbrella so that one of the shoppies can get some shade. And for the puppy blind box, we have... Oh wow, this is a yellow umbrella and it has a pink little stem, so we have one for Rainbow K as well as one for Melody. Let's put the yellow umbrella right here on this side of the patio chair. And for furniture, we also have this cute little red little tanning lounge chair. This one has the red puppy with the light pink ears and a cute face, and it has little flowers right here as a little pattern. Let's put the lounge chair right here next to the yellow umbrella. That way they can both lay out and relax together. And for this little puppy blind box. Oh wow, we have yet another umbrella. So we have three, so if another shoppie comes, they can all lay out and enjoy the sun together. Let's display this umbrella on the other side of this lounge chair. For furniture, we also got another double, but this is a yellow slide with orange ears. So now both Melodine and Rainbow Kate have their very own slide. I'm gonna place this slide going this way, that way they can both slide down in opposite directions. And the blind bag that came with that yellow slide is, ooh neat, we don't have this. This is a pink and white little sleeping bag with a little puppy as a pillow. And for our last and final piece of furniture in the Puppy Patio series, we have this cute little green tent and it has pink ears on the puppy. Let's display this little tent right here next to the slide. And for the blind box that came with the little tent, we have, ooh, this is nice, very cute. We have this little puppy patio table. I'm gonna put it here right next to the tent. We'll go ahead and put this little sleeping bag right here outside of the tent so that they can sleep under the stars. For me to complete this set, I am going to need four of the kitty kitchen still, four of the bathing bunny. For the puppy patio, I will need three. And for the dreamy bear, I am gonna need three. And then I will have the complete set. Yay! Let's go lounge outside in the sunshine. That sounds great. Nothing like home sweet home. Totally. I hope you enjoyed this unboxing of the Shopkins Happy Places series for McDonald's. Leave in the description box below what your favorite set is out of the Puppy Patio, the Dreamy Bear, the Kitty Kitchen, or the Bathing Bunny. I think my favorite is the Dreamy Bear series. And until next time, K-bye!